Hi, today I will be covering the characteristics of living organisms for GCSE Biology in 60 seconds. 3, 2, 1, go! A simple and effective way to remember all eight characteristics is by using the acronym Mrs. H. Gren. This acronym represents movement, respiration, sensitivity, homeostasis, growth, reproduction, excretion and nutrition. Movement may be moving from place to place as animals do, or the growth movements of plants in response to a stimulus. Respiration is the release of energy from food molecules and it takes place inside all living cells. Respiration can be summarised by the equation oxygen plus glucose equals carbon dioxide plus water. Sensitivity is the response to a stimulus. A stimulus is the changing surroundings of an organism, such as the effect that changing light has on the eye. Homeostasis is the maintenance of a constant internal environment, such as body temperature. Growth is a permanent increase in size and mass. Growth can also be the increase in complexity as an organism develops. Reproduction is the production of offspring and can involve either two parents with genetically different offspring or one parent with genetically identical offspring. Excretion is the removal of the toxic waste products of chemical reactions taking place in cells, also known as metabolism. All organisms need nutrition in the form of carbohydrates, lipids, proteins and nucleic acids, which are all organic molecules. Organisms can either be autotrophic and make their own food, or heterotrophic and find food from other sources. Complete! If you like this video, please take a moment to like, comment and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching!